Now there was a recent video that somebody was dissing you on, um, showing off guns and so on and so forth. And maybe within 24 hours of that video airing, dissing you, uh, they ended up dead themselves. Yeah, yeah, I had heard about that shit, but I really don't know nothing about what happened or none of that. But yeah, I heard about the situation though, yeah. You have nothing to do with that situation? <laughs> no, not, not at all. I don't know nothing about no murders. I was way in California, straight up. I don't, I don't, have, I don't know nothing about that shit. But that's definitely, you feel me, what happened and shit like that. You feel me? I get why people do lead their cities. You know what I'm saying? Like I seen the interview that Boosie did, but it's shit like that. You feel me? I'm in my city. I'm doing something positive. I'm rapping. I remove myself out of the streets. I ain't out there selling dope or none of that shit no more. You feel me? I'm, tr I'm trying to provide my niggas the opportunities to not have to either. I don't be out there getting the niggas way when I am in the city. Most of the time I spend outside the city. But when you is in the city, it's shit like that. You feel me? I go on. Motherfucker diss me for no apparent reason. You feel me? For 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 being a real nigga. You know what I'm saying? It's why motherfuckers want to play you. You know what I'm saying? The nigga, because they feel like it should be them instead of you. But when it's a motherfucker who ain't a hundred or none of that, it's cool when they doing it. Or somebody from another city, everybody respect it. But when it's always in your city, it's always your own people come at you first. And behind that situation, you feel me? I got people all on my ass, everybody who keep getting arrested from police keep telling me, or the cops keep asking about you, do you know about this or something about this? Now I'm all hot, you feel me? Behind a motherfucker getting his head bust for dissing, not saying for dissing me, but after dissing me for no reason of dissing me, you feel me? But I really think that's stemming from, like there was a motherfucker in the video that I used to extort in jail, to be honest, and I'm saying I extorting a motherfucker in jail, but that nigga ain't real, you feel me? So if that's what they extended from, the niggas ain't even rapping for a real nigga at the end of the day, you know what I'm saying? So it just be shit like that, you know what I'm saying? That's why I stay away from the city as much as I can and be moving around to get this shit, you feel me, blowing up. Now, what's your opinion of beef these days? Just in general, rap beef, period. I mean, rap beef is, it, I get it most of the time, it's to sell records, you know what I'm saying? I don't think too much shit be personal, you know what I'm saying? If it is, it really can't be if it's over wax, you know what I'm saying? Because I ain't trying to be dissing nobody over a record if it's going to be on some personal shit. So it's cool when it's about selling records. If it ain't really about that, then more than likely you you a lame. I'm saying it's sometimes it be beyond selling records. You might punch a nigga here and there too. But that's cool, you know what I'm saying? It, it is what it is. But if it's more deeper than that, it's on some gun violence shit, all that, then y'all motherfuckers nine times out of ten faking it because... How you gonna go kill a nigga after you just made a song about him, you feel me? So that's my take on, on rap beef and real beef, you feel me? Like I said, without opportunity, that's what shit, that's, is what's created. Some shit is understandable, some shit I don't understand. You know I'm saying, I don't understand how people beef with each other if it ain't even about no motherfucking money. You know I'm saying, I don't understand that type of shit. So that's my take on beef.